I've presented more than 30,000 announcements for churches over the last half decade. And in that time, I've developed a handful of church announcement scripts. And in this video, I'm gonna share seven of them with you. Well, hey there, I'm Brady Shearer from ProChurchTools.com, helping you seize the 167 hours beyond your Sunday service. We publish new videos every single week. So make sure you hit the subscribe button below. And if you like this video, I would greatly appreciate it if you gave it a thumbs up also. Give it a like. Let's dive directly directly into the good stuff. The first announcement script that I want to share with you is my countdown script. We have a five minute countdown timer at our church that is displayed on the screens before service begins. And when that countdown timer hits two minutes left, I walk onto the stage and deliver this announcement. It sets the expectations for the service and acts as a final reminder to find your seats before service begins. It goes like this. Well, hey there, welcome to Central Today, and thanks so much for spending part of your weekend with us. Uh, my name's Brady, I'm your host, and we're gonna get things kicked off here in just a couple of moments with the band. They're gonna be leading us in a few songs. The lyrics will be up on the screen, so you can sing along and engage in worship however you feel comfortable. After that, one of our pastors is gonna be out to share a great message, and all in all, we'll be here for just about an hour. If you have kids with you, we wanna let you know that we've got fantastic kids programs that's happening throughout the entire service. It's safe, it's secure, and most importantly, your kids are gonna have a blast. There's still time to check them in. Just head to the big orange wall in the lobby and you can check your kid in there. With all that being said, we're gonna get things kicked off here in just a minute. Find your seats if you haven't already and we'll get started shortly. Okay, so that's my countdown script. Now think of it as a live introduction script. I've tweaked it over the years to find something that feels right. Feel free to copy and paste it directly into one of your services or take elements of it that work for you and interweave them wherever they fit. And if that's a live introduction script, the second script I wanna share with you is an introduction script crafted specifically for video announcements. It's shorter and more succinct than the live intro script and it goes like this. Well, hey there, everyone. My name's Brady. Welcome to Central, and thanks so much for being here. There's a lot happening at Central, and so we wanted to take a few minutes and share a couple of things coming up for you and your family, so check this out. Okay, moving on. The third announcement script that I wanna share with you is my giving script. I say a version of this during service when we're taking up our tithing and our offering, and here it is. At this time, I want to invite the hosts to come forward as we give. If you're new with us, don't feel any obligation to give whatsoever. We're just so glad that you're here. If you did come prepared to give, there are a number of different ways that you can do that. You can place your gift directly in the basket as it comes down your row. You can give via debit or credit at the big blue wall in the lobby, or you can also give online. So that one is short and sweet. What I like about that script is that it covers all the bases, right? It acknowledges those that are new in service and puts them at ease. This is one of the most difficult parts for new visitors when they come to church for the first time, especially if they aren't familiar with church culture. They think to themselves, do I have to give? Do these people want my money? I try to be very clear with new people that you are under no obligation or expectation to give. And then beyond that, I just make note of each of the ways that our regular church family can give. Let's move on to announcement script number four. This is my script for new visitors. Here it is. If you're new with us today, we want you to feel at home and know that this is a safe place and we're so glad to have you here. For us, church is so much more than just a Sunday service and we want you to know that there's a place that's perfect for you at Central. One of the best ways to get connected with us is to fill out the blue card in the seat back in front of you. Take that card out sometime during the worship experience and fill out as much information as you feel comfortable. And then after service, take that card to the big blue wall in the lobby and we'll put a small gift in your hand just a small token of our appreciation for you being here. And that's it. Later this week, one of our pastors will connect with you. And once again, thanks for being here. Now, one important note that I do wanna make is that you may notice how often I use color in my announcements. Go to the big orange wall, go to the big blue wall, fill out the blue card, and there's a distinct reason for this. If I say to a new visitor, go to Connect Central, or go to the welcome desk, this can be confusing, right? And I don't want there to be any ambiguity or insider language that comes out of my mouth during announcements. Colors are a helpful way to avoid using insider language and still communicate clearly to new people that are unfamiliar with the ins and outs of the church. Let's dive into announcement script number five. This one is for small groups. Here we go. 
One thing that we truly value at Central is community. And whether today is your first time or Central has been your church for years, truly the best way to get connected with our family and start meeting others is through groups. These are so much more than a quick chat or handshake at church. Groups are where you can develop real and lasting friendships that go beyond Sunday morning. To find the group that's perfect for you, simply head to the big blue wall in the lobby. We'll see you there. Okay, and to close out these copy and paste announcement scripts for churches, let's finish with a pair of conclusion scripts. One for live and one for video. Let's start with the video conclusion script. Hey, thanks so much for being here with us today. Make sure to stay connected with us throughout the week online at centralcc.ca and on Facebook and Instagram at centralcc. We believe God has something unique to say to you and our hope is that you feel his love stronger today than ever before. Thanks again for being with us. Have a great weekend. And lastly, our seventh and final announcement script that I want to share with you, our conclusion script for a live setting. We position our live announcements between the worship and the message. And so this script is how I transition out of announcements and into the message. At this point, I've already been on stage and speaking for about five to 10 minutes. So I like to keep this transition really short and sweet. Make the transition and then I kick it to the screen for the sermon bumper. Here's how that script goes. With all that being said, we're continuing in week number two of our current message series, Reasons. Take a look at the screen. And there you have it, seven church announcement scripts, a variation of live and video scripts that you can copy and paste and use directly at your church, or feel free to just take elements that work for you, elements that you liked, and weave them into your existing announcements and promotions as needed. In the description of this video, you can find the link to the full post, which has every one of these announcements written out in full, so you can copy and paste them directly and don't feel like you have to transcribe what I'm saying. With that being said, if you like this video, make sure you hit the like button below and definitely Subscribe to the Pro Church Tools channel. We post new videos like this one every single week, helping your church seize the 167 hours beyond your Sunday service. In fact, hit the little church bell just below this video. You'll get some notifications every time we publish a new video. You'll never miss a thing. If you have comments or questions, leave them below. I'd love to hear from you. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in another video.